Local high school senior in Escambia County, Florida, is preparing for the trip of her life after being nominated as one of only two students to represent the state of Florida in a youth senate program in Washington, D.C. Fox 10 News reporter Corey Pippen brings you the story. 17-year-old Amy Sapp says she's never shied away from public speaking at Tate High School. But next March, Sapp will have the chance to speak to the country's most powerful officials in our nation's capital. I'm absolutely humbled, and I feel just incredibly blessed to have this opportunity. Sapp was chosen as one of two students in Florida to represent the state as part of the U.S. Senate Youth Program. After applying, she studied up on politics, wrote three essays, and put together a list of her accomplishments, like being named one of the top mock trial attorneys in the nation. Her final step was an interview with political representatives. They just said, what are your thoughts on this constitutional amendment? What could you change with the Constitution? What are your thoughts on politics today? It was very intimidating. I'm just a high school kid, so I thought, I don't really know if I'm going to answer these questions correctly. Along with mock trials, Sapp says she's taking advantage of every club her high school has to offer, whether it's math club or drama. Sapp says she plans to be in politics one day. Having them give me this award and say, hey, we think that maybe you're cut out for this, really solidified, all right, I am going in the right direction. And she says she has advice for any student looking to follow in her footsteps. Don't slack off freshman year because they they start looking at you your freshman year and all of high school counts. Do the best that you can to work as hard as you can. Have some fun. Reporting from Cantonment, Corey Pippen, Fox 10 News. Sapp also received a $5,000 scholarship. She'll spend a week in D.C. and is set to meet with members of the Senate and the House.